Okay, guys. Well, the beginning of the recording got messed up. But I'm still, like, really, really early in the game. So, we're going to continue The Walking Dead. Okay, so, so far, I tried to save that other guy. Um, well, what's his name? this is as far as we're going. Come on. And it's far enough. Douglas office supplies. Hey Clementine. The first part was just a bunch of audio, so I couldn't really do anything, so yeah. It's a drugstore. Look! Hey Duck. Oh yeah, Doug. Hey there! You friendly? Trucks run out of gas. <laughs> Fuck! Whoa. We're just regular folks, but we actually like helping people. You'll have to excuse her. The hell he or anyone will. This is about survival. Do you guys not see what's happening? What is it? I... I have to pee. Really, Clementine? Just go. Then just go! Oh, that's messed up. Come on, we... They've got kids, Lily. Those things outside don't care. Maybe you should go join them then. You'll have something in common. God damn it, Lily. You have to control these people. Carly and Clint just ran out there. She's not wrong. They took a risk. Yes, we did. And we appreciate it. Let's settle down. Yeah, I mean... Holy shit. Son of a bitch. One of them is bitten. Oh my god. This guy's becoming a... He wasn't bitten. A really, yeah, really he wasn't. big ape. We have to end this now. Over my dead body, we'll dig one hole. No! I'm cleaning him up! There's no bite! He's fine! Don't you fucking people get it? We've already seen this happen! We let someone with a bite stay in, and we all let the bitten shut up! We gotta throw him out! Or smash his head in! Kenny! Stop it! What, what do we do about this guy? Uh, uh... Dad, it's just a boy. Lily, I'll handle this. Put your heart, Dad. Reason with him, you kick his butt, or Tim We reason with him. With the bloody end of an axe handle, maybe. Nobody threatens my boy. Everyone chill the fuck out! Nobody's doing anything. Shut up, Lily! And you, you shut the fuck up. They will find us, and they will get in here, mm -hmm. and none of this will fucking matter. But right now, we're about to be trapped in here with one of those things! What the hell are you talking about? He's bitten! That's how you turn! He's not yeah. bitten! Please yeah. stop this! It's upsetting him! Oh, I'm upsetting him! Upsetting is getting eaten alive! Dad, we get it. It's a big deal. Sit down. Sit down! Or else. You're gonna whoop me? You and one homo parade! This one. What the? That's good. Little boy! Before you eat your mommy, you can watch your dad get his nose broken. I'm gonna kill him, cat! Just worry about Duck. Just... Lee! Oh. Yeah? There's someone in there! There's it's no one just in there. locked. He's behind yeah, the okay. counter. Yeah. Probably. Probably, yep. Hey, I'm not the bad guy here. I'm just looking out for my daughter. No, you're just the guy arguing for killing a kid. He's covered mm -hmm. in muck. She'll find the body. Watch! She won't. And if she does, the first thing he'll do is sink his teeth into his mom's face. Then, once she's dead, he'll probably pounce on your little girl. She'll turn fast. And then, there'll be three. It's a little boy. 
I think we can handle it. A little boy? Let me an uncontrollable man eater. It's not gonna happen, Pickers. And we're tossing him out now! Oh my gosh, it's not gonna happen. Calm down. Hit, hit him, Kenny. Stop him. No, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Kenny. He's right. This is about survival. Lee? This is my boy, Lee! My boy! We can't! No, he's not bitten. Look! Look, he's clean! Not a scratch! Not a goddamn scratch! What do you think about that? It's loud. And I'm fucking sorry. Good. Look, we're fish in a barrel here. With all the commotion, we could be under siege any minute. We better start fortifying this place. I'll work on getting that window barricaded. Good. Dad, sit down. I'm fine, Lily. Dad, please. Alright. Clementine! <laughs> It's gonna attract more! You okay? What'd you shoot? Just great, thanks. What'd you shoot? You shoot? No. Uh, yep, this guy knows. Uh, uh, So we can all get out of downtown Macon. Fast. Agreed. And I'll head out and get gas. There's a motel not too far from here. Out towards the end of Peach Street. I'll work my way towards it and then loop back, siphoning what I can. You're insane. You're insane. Well, it's gotta get done. Plus, I'm quick. And I know Macon. Local? Born and raised. If you're gonna do that, here's a walkie-talkie if you get in a tight spot. Hopefully, you won't need it. Cool. Clementine's got the other one. Check in with her and get back here as soon as you can. And you? What's your name? It's Lily. My dad's Larry. Keep a good eye on him. These boys will work on getting you your medicine. That's right. And you? You keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. Okay, yeah. Carly. You'll shift in with Doug when he needs it. For now, get some rest. You're a good shot. And I'd like to keep it that way. You got it, boss. Now get him those pills. Alright, uh, energy bar. Hey, Carly. Uh, I should talk to these, this guy. Heard or seen anything? Nothing, luckily. Wanna step outside, have a look around? <laughs> I'm not suicidal yet. No, the gate out there is closed. We can hang out in front of the store and be fine. Uh, uh, no, no. Uh, not right now. All right, let me know if you want to. That's that's a good idea not to go yet. Yep, trading cards. Uh, photos. We can't let anything happen to Ducky. I know, hon. Don't even come over here. Kenny. No, cat. This son of a bitch would have let that man feed our son to the wolves. Stop that, Kenny. No, we were all frightened. 
even I thought that maybe... Maybe we were going to lose our boy. I'm sorry, Katya. What if he... It's okay, Lee. From here on out, Lee, I need to know that you're on my side. I am on your side, I am. Yeah, I am, of course. Good. Thank you. Lee, you got a second? Sure. Back on Herschel's farm. Yeah. I panicked, you know. I'm not proud of it. Well, it happens. I guess. I can't stop seeing it in my head. Yeah, that's rough. I killed that boy. We could have saved him together. You didn't have a choice. You think you do when you look back on it, but in a moment, when things are really out of control, you don't have any choice. I guess. Try to let it go. I don't know why, but he looks like my uncle. Not my uncle, my whatever, me. I'm gonna say this in Spanish. If, it's, if anybody doesn't know what I'm saying, just tell me. I'll, I'll say it in English. Mi tío Rafa. He's like uh, one of my tíos. So. It's not much with here for the boy. Oh, thanks, Lee. He appreciates it. That's sweet, Lee. I don't know why. Try to some rest. Kind of How weird. can I with those things out there? Our energy bar? It's not much, but here. You sure? Yeah. You're under quite a bit of stress. I should get the next one, too. That's, uh, really sweet. The Clementine. Don't mention it. It's not much, but here you go. Thank you. Of course. Of course I'll take care of Clementine. There's an energy bar on the floor. Why would you leave it on the floor? I mean, I don't think energy bars are. No, I'm not gonna be able to get into the ATM yet. How's it doing? I'm not sure I got your name. It's Lee. Lily. My dad's Larry. I was just doing what I had to earlier. Everyone was. The house heart's acting up again, and I'm powerless to do anything. And you should know, I didn't think he was in the right. You didn't say anything, and Duck could have been bitten. Sure, I guess. You're from here? I work at Warner Robins, the Air Force base. Yeah, I know it. Pilot? Nah, just mechanical admin stuff. I deal with a bunch of shitheads and bureaucrats all day. Sometimes a plane, if I'm lucky. You? I work up at UGA. Uh, was anyone... Was anyone here when you guys got here? No, this place is pretty wrecked. We pulled a couple of bodies out of the office. Oh... Are you okay? That was his family. I remember. Yeah, I'm fine. Did you know anybody here? Yeah, the owners, they were, uh, we were close. I'm sorry. We found an older couple in the office. Dad hauled them out in case they weren't really dead. I'm gonna get back to him. Yeah. Sounds good. Okay, so, uh, let's see. Can we get into the office already? Alive inside. Wait, why is Clementine following me? Yeah, well, maybe not the sick guy. Yeah, we'll keep an eye on him. 
And there was that thing in the bathroom. It tried to get me. I know. But you stopped it. Yeah, I did. Can you do that more? I mean, get the dangerous ones. I'm gonna try. Good. I'm gonna keep looking around. Yeah, let's okay. just keep looking around until we find something very useful. Let's see, uh, exit, and then first aid kit. First aid kit? Oh, no, dirt. Or a pallet, whatever it's called. <laughs> oh man, I remember this part. What's that? This is my dad's cane. He'd zip around here on it from time to time. Was he sick? No, uh, he was okay. I actually saw him whoop shop lift his way. This game's protecting yeah, this yeah, place better than any god dog ever could. Plus, you know how to make it look like you and yeah. My dad gave it to me. See, dad's just smart like that. Yeah, that'd be nice. I'm really nice. I mean, I'm really nice right now. I have a clear path to open the that door. Oh, no, really, dirt? Why don't you press Where the get this door clear, huh? Can I help? <laughs> sure. Here we go. Watch your yep. fingers in the drawers. Mm. How are you doing? Yeah, it's not that heavy. How about with everything outside? It's not good. No, it's not. But I think it'll be okay. Okay, here we go. Mm. Kids? Uh, no. You don't have a family? Let's not talk about that. Do you play sports? I play soccer, but I don't really like it. <laughs> I'm not crazy about it either. Alright, a little further. Me neither do I. I mean, I wasn't a <sighs> soccer team. But, you know, I didn't really like it either. Yeah. Why don't you want to talk about your family? Do they, like, hate you? That's kind of messed up. I hope not. It's just complicated, that's all. Why? It just is. But you love them, right? Yeah, of course. Look, my family's gone, and I just wish things would have been different. Yeah. I got into some trouble and I didn't talk to them for a while. This used to be their store. But let's just keep that between you and me, okay? Okay, because of the trouble? Yeah, that's right. Now, uh, let's get this done. Yeah, let's just finish this off. Come on. Come on, Clemmy. No! Oh. Oh. Are you okay? They hurt my finger. Is it bleeding? A little. A little. That thing was like spewing out blood. Jesus. I found your bandage. <laughs> I'm serious. That thing was like. Jeez. All right. Uh, wasn't there a? Yeah, there was a first aid kit here. All right. What else could we do? Oh, remote. Get the remote. It's the remote to my dad's TV. Lee? Huh? Well, yeah. Why did my parents come home when I'm not there? They'll, uh, try to find us. Don't worry. Yeah, okay. Well, we should keep a lookout. I've got my walkie talkie in case they try that way. Stay close to me until then, okay? Let's have a look at that finger. Oh. It hurt. Let's see if we can do something about it. Let's get this cut covered up. Yes, please.
Ma magic. <laughs> he didn't even move his finger. He's like. How's it fit? It's okay. Thanks for fixing it. Have you heard from Glenn? Not in a little while. I'm gonna keep looking around. Okay. Anything else in here? Luckily, there's nothing I need in here. Oh, I can use the TV remote. That's what I figured. Come on, Clemmy. Let's go. Right, I should have given the other bar to the to that one girl. Uh ah, doesn't need one. Here, I would find us some stuff to eat. Oh, um, thanks. You're welcome. Are you sure your girl doesn't eat it? She's good. I'm trying to keep her fed and watered. You're a good caretaker. Thanks. Hey there. This is Glenn, and, uh, I'm kinda in a jam here. Uh, little girl, if you're there, can you put your daddy on the phone? Or on the talkie, or whatever? This is Lee. What's up? So, I'm down at the motor in, and, well, mm -hmm. uh, I'm stuck. Stuck? Yeah, I, uh, saw a chance to get some supplies for the group, and a bunch of the Roman ones got to jump on me. I'm hiding over here, but they won't leave. What's up? Glenn's trapped down at the motor here. They won't hey, leave. Glenn, we're gonna talk it over and send a group to come get you, alright? Awesome. I'll sit tight till then. Sounds good. Alright, guys, I'm gonna have to end here. Back, okay? I'll take good care. See you guys in the next time. What do you time. think? I think Doug's not great around zombies. You got your family here. I'll okay. take Carly and her dead eye down to the motor and get Glenn and get back here as fast as I can. If that's what you wanna do. Somebody's got to. Yeah, I'm in. Good. Doesn't sound too bad there right now. Let me know as soon as you want to head out. I could use a job. 